Hola clase, buenos dias. Today I'm just gonna run through real quick what the work that I assigned for you all is. So it's this right here, classroom expression, saludos y despedidas tarea for the days in which I will be out this week. Um, so you are to use the notes that I linked below to guide you in completing this assignment. And please submit the assignment by the end of the class on the day of my absence, okay? So um, you will attend the Meet, the Google Meet, um, and make sure that you work on this during the time of the Meet and submit it by the end of class. So let's take a quick look at it. Just let me just explain it a little bit to you guys. So here's the tarea. Here is the... Um, Here's a work for you guys. So here's the, our instrucciones for numbers uno through tres, one through three. Fill in the blanks with the appropriate word from your classroom expressions note sheet and translate them into English on the longer line below. So for the rest of the problems four through 10, you will use your classroom expressions note sheet and saludos y despedidas notes. So let's take a look here. <clears throat> I have up here in the tabs our notes. So for numero uno, hola, buenas tardes, blank, una pregunta. What we're going to do here is actually going to jump to our notes. I have this open here. Blank, una pregunta. Let's find it. Let's find the word that's missing. And when you find the word that's missing, you put the word that's missing on this line. Now you have a complete sentence. And then on the bottom line, you put it into English. The whole thing completed. What the sentence was stated once it's complete. You will do the same for dos and tres. The same thing. All right, number four. How might you respond to gracias? So we're going to look at our notes again. What does gracias mean? It means thank you. So what logically would you say... In response to that, you're going to put that on the line there, and that's it. Uh, numero cinco, what are three expressions that you could use if you don't understand? Well, let's look at our notes here. Imagine you don't understand something. Pick three that might logically um, be in response to you not understanding something. Pick any three here from our notes. Put them on the line. And then translate them in order. Right? What do they mean in English? In English. Numero seis. Translate the following conversation into Spanish. Hello, good afternoon. I have a question. Repeat, please. May I go to the nurse? Person sneezes. You don't have to translate this part right here, but that's just to give some uh, some context to this this conversation here. I'm sorry. Bless you. See you later. Let's take a look at. Our note sheet here and we'll put the we'll find the right words and expressions and put them where they need to go. Um, numero siete, number seven, correct the spelling in this phrase. Hola, buenos noches. Let's take a look at our saludos y despedidas notes. This right here. Um, let's look at good evening, good night, right? Which is the unspelt part? How do we correct the spelling? Let's jump back and do that. Okay. Um, same thing for numero ocho. Take a look at your notes. All right. Where is the misspelt part? You're going to need to read carefully for this. Okay. Next one. Um, same thing. You're going to look at that phrase there. And where is the misspelt part take a look back at our notes here and then numero 10 last one if a student asked puedo ir a la enfermera the student was probably a mal b bien c así así so first let's look at puedo ir a la enfermera on our classroom expressions note sheet expresiones de la clase what does that mean uh, puedo ir a la enfermera it means that so now let's jump to our notes for saludos y despedidas. What, um, what would we go with? Bien, mal, or así, así? If someone was asking, puedo ir a la enfermera. And that's it. That's the tarea. That is your work. Make sure you 
submit it on time. Um, by the end of class, on the day in which I am out. And also, um, please be sure to check in to the Google Meet because um, the visiting educator will be taking attendance and you will be receiving participation for the day for attending the Meet. Gracias, hasta luego y adiós.